My name is Dr. Josphat Gikunde. I'm a consultant obstetrician and gynecologist. I'm a member of class. Hysteroscopy is a procedure whereby we look at the cavity of the uterus. This is done using a thin tube with a camera. This tube goes from the vagina through the cervix into the uterine cavity. Because it has a camera, you are able to, to visualize the uterine cavity. We can use it for either diagnosis or operative. That's why we talk about uh, diagnostic hysteroscopy as opposed to operative hysteroscopy. Diagnostic hysteroscopy is whereby once you put the camera into the cavity, you would like to see what are the pathology that maybe the client or the patient presented with. Some of the patients might have come with issues such as bleeding, which have been caused by, by fibroids. Sometimes you have fibroids that are protruded into the uterine cavity, which medically call them some mucosal fibroids. Uh, through hysteroscopy, you're able to visualize them, that is diagnosis, that which means you may be confirmed. The patient may have had an ultrasound that's shown she has some fibroids. Once you do the hysteroscopy, you see the pathology and then you're able to operate on them. In this unit, we be able to remove some because of fibroids that have been as big as six to eight centimeters. And the advantage of it is that uh, the patient is able to go home the same day. Um, the other, you can also, we have uh, polyps that can also be reduced, re removed uh, hysteroscopically. You might have uh, the patient who present with infertility. You want to find out what's the cause of infertility. Sometimes they have what are called additions, which are scar, scar tissue or scar bands inside the uterine cavity that can be removed hysteroscopically. Um, ideally, even the patients who go for the IVF, which is the test tube babies, um, the IVF procedures, ideally they should have a diagnostic hysteroscopy done before going for IVF to ensure that the uterine cavity is fine and is able to for the implantation to take place. Uh, other incidences, you might have um, family, uh, you might have uh, uh, coils, which people call maybe the copper tea, which is a form of family planning device that sometimes get misplaced or in the uterine cavity. You are able to pick it um, in a very, you are able to pick it clearly when you do hysteroscopy. Sometimes you can also take biopsies. You know, people uh, will have postmenopausal bleeding and you like to take a biopsy of the endometrium lining, which is again can be done through hysteroscopy. Thank you.